Okay I don't know what this is. I'm an amateur photographer and camera collector. I ordered a new Polaroid off Amazon a few days ago. I know I sound like a total faggot but I'm big into cameras and was really excited for the camera to arrive. Anyways I have a problem where I get overexcited and can't fall asleep, I have a sleeping aid that I take when I get too hyped up. The camera was supposed to arrive the next morning so I had to take my pill to sleep. I was out like a light. So I had this weird dream. In the dream I was standing on, and surrounded by this whitish greenish rock like material. There were mountains made of it and spires and all sorts of strange formations jutting out left and right. The sky in my dream was black with green and purple static. In my dream my Polaroid was around my neck. I only had one picture to take so I was waiting for something really good. All the sudden the monster started emerging from the ground surrounded by purple smoke. I took a picture. Then it ran up to me and I woke up. I opened my door to find my Amazon box on the ground. I opened it and pulled out my Polaroid, this was inside it. It's the photo from my dream. I'm seriously freaked out and I'm considering staying the night with a friend, or at least taking a double dose of my medicine. What do you guys make of this? Can you timestamp the photo? I'm not sure how to date physical photographs. I suppose I could take it to a professional. Anyways there's not much to really be scared about yet. Maybe you saw the Polaroid before you went to bed, and just forgot. The picture could have appeared in your dream. I don't know. But it arrived the day after. I don't know maybe my mind is playing tricks on me but I am pretty freaked out. Your information is insufficient, where did you buy that from? What is the name of the seller? The item page? And that photo seems really shitty quality. Get it scanned better. I can't make out what is going on in the picture. Like I said Amazon. This is the specific camera. Don't remember the seller but I'll look. As for picture, I'll try scanning it again but it was blurry and ill lit to begin with. Here is one in a little higher quality. Still blurry as crap though. Hey OP, could you outline the monster in the picture? All I see is a black blob. Okay guys I had another weird dream last night. This time I was in some kind of cave. I had my camera again. It was dark and there was this strange birdish creature walking in through the mouth of the cave. I once again took a picture. When I woke up I went to my night cam to see what had happened while I was asleep. I uploaded it to Vimeo for you guys. I looked at the slideshow and well, it's interesting. The finale picture is obviously not of my room, but it's not exactly the one I took in my dream either. I mean it looks very similar but I remember taking it at a different angle. Also my door opens at the end. It could have been my air conditioning. I don't know I'm still super weirded out. I took out my SD card to look for the last picture of my room. I will post if I find anything. Implying you couldn't have opened the door yourself. 
Look mate unless you are willing to go all out in investigating this we aren't interested. I mean what am I supposed to do? I guess I could have opened the door to use the bathroom or something. How should I investigate? I think I found the finale picture of my room on my SD card. The timestamp fits anyway. It's all corrupted though. Sounds like your sleeping meds cause a half asleep slash half awake state, where you're dreaming in your mind but actually physically doing everything you dream you are doing. I DK what meds you take so I can't confirm, but this is a recorded phenomenon with some sleeping meds, in fact it is often listed as a side effect. I DK about what the pictures could be but I'm leaning towards something to do with the veil like other Anon said. Okay guys I'm going to try going outside taking pictures with the Polaroid. I'll develop them and scan them in and we'll see if there is anything spooky. Okay so I took like three more pictures and three more black images. This one had a bit of an odd shape on it thought so I figured I'd post it. They pretty much all look like this. Black with a little bit of grey variations here and there. I'm going to take the camera apart and see if I can get it to work. Crap the camera has screws that don't fit with any of my screwdrivers. I'm going to run to the store and pick up a matching one. I checked three stores and couldn't find even one driver that matched the screw. I might have to take it apart some other way. Got it open. I had to pry the screws out. No wonder it didn't work it had a bunch of freaking film all over the inside. Some idiot who doesn't know how to use cameras must have thought this was a video camera, taken the camera apart and put this inside. What the hell? I gave myself a name now just letting you know. Now that I've taken the camera apart by fairly rough means I have the task of putting it back together. I'll let you know what happens next. I should be done putting the camera together. What should I do then? Set up another night cam or what? Aside from taking pictures with the camera I don't know what to do next as far as investigating goes. Should be done putting the camera together soon. I'm pretty much done with fixing the camera. I'll take some pics tomorrow and post them here. Do you guys have any suggestions for anything else I should do? A night cam might be interesting, but I'm not really sure man. I did one last night. The video is above if you look. I suppose I can do another tonight. Ah, uh, I see. Well, it produced interesting results last time. I'd say give it a shot. Okay I will. Okay so I didn't catch anything on my night cam. I'm going to take some pictures with it now. The pictures are totally normal. Nothing wrong now. Case closed I guess. Anything else I should do guys or are we finished? Sorry forgot to put my name on that one. Develop the film to see if it had been used. Crap that is a good idea BRB. I developed the film. There isn't any footage on it, but I noticed some weird distortion. There are several of them all evenly spaced and the same size. There are five all together. All the stripes look pretty similar. Some colors and stuff. Holy crap guys I cut the tape to look at the distorted pieces, I it looks like some kind of puzzle. Like they go together and make a picture of another freaky looking thing. Give me a sec while I scan it in. There. I moved them around a bit with editing to get it more exact, but here it is. I think it's the same thing from the first picture. If you're serious about the sleep aid what do you take? I suffer from something similar. Sleep is so hard for me. Doxapin. Great, now I'm scared again. Maybe I'm just paranoid but I swear I can hear a lady whispering whenever quietly. The sound is coming through my air vent. I also heard a loud thud coming from my living room but when I got up to check nothing had happened. That is cut up pieces of the film that was trapped inside the camera. The one I talked about before that was messing up the photos. Okay I took your advice guys. I took a picture of my vent with my Polaroid while I was feeling weird and heard the noises. Okay guys I took the vent off and took a picture of the inside. 
I'm waiting for it to develop. This photo is taking a really long time to develop they are typically finished in half the time. Okay. Turns out it was done developing. It's just another messed up back image like before. This is definitely not the picture I took of my vent. Guess I'll try and take another one. What? Oh my god. What is it? Should I take another picture or GTFO? I've gone to the bedroom at the other end of the house and locked the door for now. I don't feel comfortable in my room. Okay guys I just went and videoed myself trying to open the vent. I saw some blue thing in the window and ran out. I'm leaving my house and spending the night with a friend. I don't know when I'll be back. The video will be on Vimeo shortly. Guys I'm freaking out. I swear I can still hear the damn lady whispering. My body is shaking. I'm stopping at the gas station and telling my friend to meet me here. Editor's note. The video OP posted is, as far as I am aware, now lost or deleted. But some announce made screen caps of the video. In case anything else happens this time I brought a pretty nice video camera. Guys my friend says he'll be at the gas station soon. I'm a bit more chilled out now. I'm getting out of here. I'm going to bed guys. I'll check back in in the morning. Before I sleep do guys think I should set up a night cam? Maybe, just in case. Yes, only just in case. Okay I will. Guys I can't find my Polaroid. I'm pretty sure I brought it and my friend says he saw me with it, but it's nowhere to be seen to find it. We are still looking. I'll let you know what happens next. BTW, the video from the night cam I set up is still processing. Me and my friend are going to grab some lunch I'll be back with you guys in a bit. Okay I'm looking through the night cam footage from last night while my friend looks for the camera. I found something weird on the tape. It might have just been one of us coming back in or something, but I don't see any footage of us leaving the room. Since it is a all night cam it has a two minute period between every hour where it doesn't record it and makes a new file, but one of us would have had to leave them room for a long while because the thing appears right before a two minute cut out. My friend says he didn't. This doesn't really look ghostly per se. I don't know I'll Vimeo it and you guys tell me what you think. Okay here you go. I know my friend has a habit of sleepwalking, so it might be that. These don't look like the clothes he slept in though. I don't know. It is a low quality night vision cam so the blur and lack of color might be of thanks for that. Okay there is no way my camera is in this house. We've looked everywhere. I'm going to call the gas station and see what they say. I called the gas station and they said they hadn't seen it. OP, do you think the camera is in the vent? Where that eel demon lives? I'm not sure. We are discussing going back to my house to look for it. Okay, we are going back to my house to look for the Polaroid. Check back with you guys in a bit. There are scratches all over my front door. Another pick. We got inside and everything seems normal. Except the door to my room is locked and my key isn't working. My friend is trying to pick it with a paper clip. Question is, where was the Polaroid? We don't have it. I just took these pics with my old phone. We can't get in through my door. It wouldn't budge. We gonna try climbing in through the window. There is something white. 
blocking the window. It was a mattress. My mattress was moved in front of the window. My room is totally trashed. We are searching for the camera. There is this sticky black fur all over the place. I'm taking them on my phone, which is like 5 or 6 years old, so I can upload them quick. I can't find it. I don't think the camera is in here. The hair is mostly under the air vent. Oh wait guys there is a hole in my mattress. I cut the hole and reached in. There is an undeveloped film inside. I'm running to my studio to develop it. The image has some kind of scribbling at the top. Above the undeveloped part of the image. Here it is. My friend and are now getting the heck out of here. I'm staying at his place and I don't know when I'm coming back. Hopefully my anxiety pill can calm me down. Basically you can see the creature here pretty good. Looks like a gremlin. Oh my god. It's the monster from my dream. I can't handle this I'm taking another anxiety pill. All I can offer. Is trying to decipher it. Concludes Duck Monster and Eel are developing a new type of drug and they're on it. non -vidibitous. You will not see. non -vidibimus. We will not see. Hey guys. I'm back at my friend's place. Still scared as hell. What's up guys? I'm fine, still a bit spooked. No weird things have happened. I am getting my air conditioner fixed cause the dang thing won't work. It's all good, not much has happened. My friend is staying with me till I feel good again. My thanks is with all of you for caring enough to do all this. Hopefully I'll finish a project for Vimeo soon. Watching me. Found this picture in the vent, have to be quick they know.